ended by the deadline which was set before. <laughs> Rarely happens, I'll come to that too. I found, I recently found a very good one to explain also the difference between groups and teams. When there's a bunch of people stuck in, when there's a bunch of people in an elevator, there's a group. A team is also a bunch of people stuck in the elevator, except that's when the elevator was broken. <laughs> All of a sudden, you have a common goal, you want to get out. So, the main difference could be groups, usually our groups are also larger, you are a group. If I set you up in smaller teams, which we'll do in a minute, with a task, specific task, you will become a team. Now, I'm not going to do the work today. You guys are going to do the work. <laughs> I need none less than 12 volunteers, 12 people. 12 people on stage, go. Tell me when you see 12. sheet and when they're gone, there's 10 people here and 10 people here. These 10 people on each side, these 20 people have got an observation task. They must observe the groups. And you also have a letter on it, A, B or C. Now make sure that you're in a position where you can see the team that you need to observe. For example, if you're over there and you need to observe team A, you may want to move there because that's team A. Right? Okay. All right, good. <laughs> Are you all ready? Those of you, those of you who didn't get any task, you will just observe everybody. You will observe what's going on on stage and you will observe what the observers are doing. <laughs> okay? <laughs> it will all make sense at the end. Now, you guys have seen what you need to do as a team? Please do read your task. It's not brain surgery. You just observed. Are the teams ready? No. The teams who got the green card, so team A and B, make sure you read the green card too. It's very important. Now, important, important is that you 
work on it, if you don't come to a result, 